Clark County, where commissioners made what could turn out to be a very controversial decision today. They voted to ban all the growing, processing, and selling of recreational marijuana, even though Washington state voters approved a measure legalizing that drug. And Tim Becker joins us live now with this Coin 6 follow up. Tim? Yeah, Jenny, you know, ultimately it is a controversial decision already. I say that because things got pretty heated up in here behind me when the commissioners were hearing testimony on the topic. Ultimately, they voted for the ban, citing federal law as their justification. Where do you get off on the jurisdiction of that? Where do you think you have jurisdiction to do stuff like that? Tempers flared as people questioned the ban. What it basically means is that I put all this money out and now I'm stuck. Voters statewide approved recreational pot use in 2012. So how can Clark County now say it's illegal? Good question, and I think some of the testimony we heard today uh, is by folks that are saying that you local governments can't ban this because we allow it by the state. County planner Gordon Euler tells me the ordinance commissioners voted in follows a model already used in Pierce County, flexing its power to issue land permits and backed by the federal ban on recreational pot use, something Commissioner David Medore reiterated. Commissioner Medore today said, uh, my oath of office says I will obey the laws of the United States. And he's pointing to that and saying the law of the United States says that marijuana is illegal. At the end of the day, we've been doing this a long time and um, we're patient and it's a big change for people to get used to and, and hopefully we can all work together and, and, and find, a, find a result. Bobby Saberi owns Mary Jane's House of Glass and tells me he's not surprised by today's ban. His business is still welcome in the city of Vancouver, where they chose to follow state law instead of federal law. This is complicated stuff, isn't it? I mean, you got you got the feds banning it, you've got the state saying it's okay, you've got the county saying, okay, we're gonna ban it, you got a city saying it's okay. That's like a four-layered sandwich. It is, and it's it's hard to know what's the best way to proceed. And when I sue the county on this. And not everyone's happy the way it went here today. All those in favor? Aye. Aye. It has passed. Uh and so there you have it. It has passed. Again, the ban in effect for only unincorporated parts of Clark County, and it will remain that way. It will stay that way until marijuana is no longer listed as a federally controlled substance. That said, the city of Washougal is now contemplating doing the same thing there at their city council meeting tonight. We're going to be sure and follow up on that and let you know what happens there. For now, reporting live in Vancouver, Tim Becker, COIN6 News.